I would say I've been working with the first team since uh, 2009. I think it's one of the tasks that you have as a staff to, to see that the, that the club grows in, in different ways. Uh, of course, my responsibility is, uh, in the end, the results of the team, uh, but also to make the uh, club grow in uh, other aspects is also something that contributes, I think, in the end to the results. So it's a, it's a pleasure. I felt that I wanted to play football in Sweden. I didn't want to wait too long until I kind of like had to struggle through six months and then retire. I wanted to be able to come back and, and, and help the team and achieve something. Um, and yeah, for me, it was an easy decision to, to join ARK. Once I knew they were interested, uh, it was pretty straightforward, to be honest. You realize when you're here what a big club it is back home. You can't hide from the fact that it means a lot to a lot of people, and especially building up to the first game of the season, uh, like it is now, it's, it's an exciting time. Yeah, for sure. Uh, I think any footballer wants to get the pre-season out of the way as quick as possible, and and get going in the league so um, and you know I'm, I've heard a lot of things about the first game at home and, and excited to see what it's like. As a player to play for AK I think it's uh, in Sweden it's the biggest thing you can do. Uh, I've been here since I was 14 so to to play uh, to play one game for the for the first team has been just to play one game has been my dream since I was a kid. And now I've uh, been playing around 100 games, and that's that's even more you can dream of. For, to play for this club, it's it's everything. My involvement is uh, pretty much in the Tifusi end. Make sure that it's a great atmosphere, standing on the north terrace. Sure that uh, the singing, the atmosphere, flags. Uh, then we have the part of. Uh, flares and everything like that is also a big part of the culture that we like and we try to uh, embrace. Uh, it says Kjellik uh, Uppror. For us it's the resemblance uh, of what you go through passion-wise by supporting uh, AIK. Uh, we will always be there when everything is happy go lucky but we will be there uh, supporting the club uh, in every way even though we play in the fifth division or something like that we are here for the club uh, through thick and thin Raised, so it's, uh, it's a, it means a lot to me. Uh, I was uh, I took my first steps here. I was playing uh, football with my dad for the first time here. So so knowing also that uh, the team that I started playing in uh, is just you know down down the hill. So of course it's an amazing feeling and uh, it just feels great to be here. a lot of us because we grew up together and uh, you know they've been following ARK since we were young so you know for me being play, playing that at the moment uh, feels you know uh, good for them also and they of course they're proud of that but you know it's like kind of we fought together and uh, now when I, when, I, when I play there so they feel of course uh, they're involved in some, some, somehow so I took my first steps in this team, so and uh, when I came back last summer, uh, my my dream and my goal was to, to take the goal. And uh, when we did it, it was uh, like this whole you know neighborhood uh, took it together. So to bring it here, bring it home uh, to my family, of course, they, because they are also here. So it feels you know just like I, I succeed. Yeah, 
Yeah, of course. You know, all, all of the young guys' dreams, you know, when as they grow up, is to play in this team and, uh, of course, to win the gold. But uh, mainly to just be able to play in, in AIK. And my dream as a young kid was that. And you see every day young people, uh, you know, playing soccer and trying to, to achieve their dreams. And, and being there and being one of their, uh, you know, idol or somehow, you know, inspiration, you know, it's, it feels like where, where I started. So it's all always special. Wow, the atmosphere starts even before the game. We have this uh, bus receiving. The fans is waiting outside the arena and waiting for us to come uh, with the bus. And it starts, it starts there, really. You can see there's a lot of people coming there. You can, it's with flares, they have everything, fireworks, and really get you pumped up for the game. During that time, you can see fans on the roads and uh, until we arrive, so. It's just a special feeling, you know, when you see all the fans and... First game of the season, uh, it's going to be a great atmosphere. We're going to welcome the bus with the players uh, before the game. Uh, it's a tradition that we have uh, before every premiere in the Allsvenskan. And uh, inside the stadium, it's going to be so, many, so much uh, expectation. When you come into arena, you will see the great t uh, tifo they have, and this this kind of thing that really gets you going before the game. So it's it's amazing. It's it's experience you take uh, take with you the whole life. It's just a special feeling, you know, when you see all the fans and like celebrating you to start off the season, and uh, that's always a special feeling, and uh, it motivates you more, and also shows what kind of fans we have. It's good here, we've been strong here at home, so yeah, it's, it's lovely to go out and play in front of the fans there. You know, all of, the, all of them here, you know, they are like, they're fanatic, you know, they, like I said, you know, the arena and the stadium and the old stadium is just like 100 meters from here, so all of us who lived here, we, we grew up with the team in our hearts, so it's always a special feeling. When you see the club, um, you know, getting bigger and, and more recognized uh, around the world, that's, that's just positive for everyone. I saw on AIK's Instagram yesterday, I saw one fan from San Francisco waking up five, five in the morning and uh, watching the games. And I think he's even traveling here on, on Sunday to watch the premiere. That kind of stuff motivates you as a player to see that AIK is such a, has such a big impact on people. One of the fun sides about this that uh, the club has such huge potential and, and to use that potential in, in uh, more ways than to win football matches is, uh, I think it's, uh, it's the only way to go if you want to develop the club. What does AIK stand for again? Almena Idrottsklubben. And that means? Well, how to say it in English is, it's the people's club. <laughs> <laughs> 